right, just got done taking that off. Waiting for my friend to come bring the his big hex nut for that. To remove that off with the socket. Uh, I took that one off. I have a clip of pulling that off. Usually everyone uses an um, air compressor, but I don't have one. So what I used, compressed air, can air. Took it off. Um, gonna slip that off. All this was held on by some uh, screws. That, the right grip, you unscrew it. Then I loosened up the throttle cables. Pulled the little buttons out with the cables on there and you can slip the handle right off. Have to figure out how to drill a hole into my other bar. My new ones are come my new ones are here. And then if you can see it, there's a blue line that I marked. And right underneath on the on the bottom, there's another hole which is for this little insert here. There's a little button right there that needs to go inside so you don't have any twisting of the throttle. Alright. Talk to you guys in a bit. Alright, after a couple of hours of adjusting and drilling, finally got the bars on. There's the Vortex logo right on top. Got it adjusted. I think to where it was where I like it. I think I, I moved everything down further on the bar since the bars are 12 inches long. And um, I did choke up on it a bit up at the top. There's an inch there. So I could go further, but I don't think I need to. And um, yeah, can't wait to take a test ride with it. Um, but right now, we got rain. So hopefully it'll dry up soon. Later. Alright guys, I got my handlebars on, I like it. So I had the brake lever, the brake uh, master cylinder, whatever, the fluid holder, <laughs> uh, zip tied and so now I'm tapping it. I drilled the hole, went to Home Depot, bought a the little set for a six millimeter bolt and um, what I'm doing is I'm slowly going in and then flipping the switch and backing out a little bit so the shavings come out and uh yeah gonna tap it and i bought a have a little right angle bracket to mount the the brake canister on there it is see it so we'll see how it goes all right all installed there it is and there, I had a little locking nut to go and fit on the opposite end. That machine screw, I might go a little bit longer on that screw just so that it gets in locked into that spot. But if you can see, there it is. No hitting. It was, I got <clears throat> about a quarter of an inch clearance. All right, done.